What's going on guys, your boy Maze, we're back with another video, and in today's video guys, me doing the PvP showcase for the brand new LR Margaret, guys. I was actually able to create, uh, or make her LR, uh, just now. I had to get a bunch of <laughs> hero enhanced potions to actually get it done, but as you guys can see, LR Margaret is here. Um, we do have her at the 74k CC, guys. We do have, like, the full HP defense, UR gear, all that good stuff. Uh, I mean, uh, this is my Margaret. I do have all their cosmetics maxed out, uh, including the new LR ones too. We added those on as well. And so now, obviously, with all this, we have like the max CC. And we're going to be taking her into ungeared PvP, guys. Since as you guys can see, I'm in Champion 3. I got deranked a lot. So hopefully we can win some matches with this team right here. But uh, yeah, man. And another, another thing as well is I don't have ELA built yet. Because I actually just don't have SSR Pendants, man. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> if I had SSR Pendants, I would level her up, but I, I just ran out. So, unfortunately, I can't uh, use her on the team. But we got Tristan backline. I think he'll still be really good. Um, for you guys that don't know, Tristan gives 45% defense-related stats uh, for the Goddess team. And uh, with the team I'm running here, with uh, Light Liz, Tarmia Link, you know, it's going to be very, very tanky and hard to kill. So, all right, guys. So, before we actually hop into the match, make sure to subscribe to your boy Amazing. We are on the road to the 40,000 subscribers. Your boy is at what? Like 38,900 now, guys? we're literally 100 away from the 40k and then we're or 100 away from the 39k and then 1100 away from the 40k so definitely make sure to subscribe if you guys haven't already without the way man we're gonna hop in with this team right here uh red tarmiel link light liz uh mile right here with the uh lr melee link uh, Ma uh margaret there with the uh lr Askinor link and then lr uh liz link on tristan backline so let's hop in and let's see what this team's able to do all right guys we are hopping into the first match of the video here we got a human team okay that's uh you know a little different i usually don't see human teams too often in pvp but um this is the team we're going to be using uh or going to be facing here let's do aoe with uh, margaret here and then we'll go for the aoe with mael and then i guess single target whoever who has tarmiel link on that team it's the roxy so we'll just go for the Escanor, i guess yeah i mean let's just see we're building up basic stats every time we attack because we have uh light liz on the team so that's obviously really good aoe with mael good chunk of damage uh let's see the single target follow-up yeah it's not going to do like too much because we didn't really build up with the uh with the margaret uh buffs yet right we need to cleanse debuffs to actually get the margaret passive going and uh, unfortunately i, I guess because it's transcendent bond though this team's gonna be pretty good to uh, face actually so right there uh with the tarmiel link right there on liz we should actually tank this fairly well um single target with esnor does nothing on uh, margaret as well and we do actually tank that this is gonna do a little bit um because it's gonna do the roxy damage past the damage cap um but we are good here and for you guys that don't know the way margaret works here when we actually do cleanse right here guys so from our passive uh, if we cleanse uh, debuffs, we actually do get crit chance and crit damage up to five uh, debuffs. So if we cleanse this right here. We do this, and then we do, or I guess we'll do um, cleanse AOE, and then I'll do this single target right here into LRS, and that's gonna remove him from the battlefield, and we don't have to worry about him. We're also gonna get a full heal here too, because uh, the moment you use six cards with LR or with Light Elizabeth, we actually do get the full heal right here. So. Miles gonna kill the uh, LR Asuna right there, and now we're in a pretty good position because we're gonna full heal. We're gonna cleanse all the debuffs. We have big crit chance, crit damage now, and this is gonna be really nice. We don't, uh, we on only have a uh, light list cards here, but I think we should still be good in terms of dealing with the uh, with the uh, Roxy team. Let's see how much are we taking. Yeah, look how tanky our team is with Tristan, man. Tristan backline is really nice, so obviously to help the tanking. This is against a Roxy with, uh, you know, obviously her Holy Relic here. So she should be hitting super hard. But look at that. She's missing crits now. That's crazy, bro. Tristan backline, man. Look at that, yo. That's actually insane. He's hitting a few, but he's not hit he's not hitting all the crits. That already goes to show how strong, like, this team actually can be. So let's do the cleanse here. Let's do the uh, AoE with Margaret right there. And then uh, what I'll do is I'll do the single target with Light Liz uh, into the uh, bond right there. And with that, um, that's going to be able to make it so we have Margaret ultimate. And we can actually see how much damage her ultimate does too. So that rank 1 right there does 134. Pretty good. And then single target Light Liz, let's see how much this is doing. Oh, the crit damage. You can see that. You guys can actually see the crit chance crit damage there. I actually did a lot of damage on that, on that uh, transcendent bond right there, man. Pretty good. And then... Uh, Patiencing my Margaret. Don't forfeit. Don't forfeit. Please, bro. I want to get this ultimate off. Let's see. This this ultimate from Roxy should not kill my Margaret. Let's see. Block affected. Doesn't even crit. Okay, don't forfeit, please. I want to get this ultimate off, bro. I'm curious to see how much this does. Let me get it off. Let me get it off. Alright, there we go. Oh, this is a bot. Okay, I just took that in. This is a bot. It's a bot. Let's see. See the damage from Margaret right here? And boom, 480k. Pretty good, man. And now we get that extra damage dealt. So now uh Miles single target. 
Yeah, no, this is not a bad team, guys. I think Goddess Team is definitely a uh, usable team now in PvP, it seems like. You know, that was against a human team, right? Humans are obviously like, not the, the very best team in the game, because unknowns, I feel like, right now are probably the number one team. But, I mean, that's still pretty good. That was a bot, though, to be fair. We got to get an actual player to see, like, really what it's about. But let's hop into the next match, guys, and we'll see what we're able to do. Alright guys, we're hopping into the next match here against a tier unknown team. That This is where I'm really curious to see how well this team performs, right? Against an unknown team, this will be a good showing. Um, let's bait out the evade food right there. Let's do AoE. And then we're actually going to cleanse this so that we cleanse the debuffs and get the full passive for... Uh uh, for what's it called for the for the marker right there. So yeah, we go for the aoe crew resistance lower We go for the cleanse right here and that's gonna get us the full passive right there for Margaret So you guys know Margaret gives the uh, crit chance crit damage for every debuff cleanse since we cleanse six debuffs right there We should have the max passive now and so now when attacking especially with the hand we have right here This could be pretty good man Unless he has um, I mean he's gonna put up a top probably with uh thing. Let's see how much damage this tier is doing. Let's see no crits, yeah, because Tristan backline is obviously really, really strong. Single target follow-up. Yeah, no, no crits, man. Tier, he's not critting. He's not critting. Look at that. That's crazy. Single target from the hell. Let's see. No crits either. Pretty good, man. Pretty good. Okay, I'm going to go for the AoE Margaret here. And then go for AoE Mile and then single target onto the tier. I think that's going to do a lot of damage. So let's do this. Let's do this. And then let's do single target into the uh, tier right there. Let's see. This is going to crit resistance lower, and that right there, 155k, not bad. We go for the AoE right here. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, guys. Miles hitting super hard there. Okay, yeah, Albedo's a little bit too tanky, but dang, man, that's A. That's a real player, too. That's a real player as well. Yo, Mile, okay. Mile, okay. Okay. I like it. I like it. All right, next match. Let's see what this team's able to do. That was a good showing, though, guys. Definitely a really, really good showing there. Alright guys, we are hopping into the next match of the video. We got a demon team here. Let's see if we can beat demon team with the goddess team. Now, the thing is with the demon team, right? They obviously get really, really strong with the fact that demon king is going to be uh, getting that all stats on the turn two. We get, we're going to have to try and, and, and be able to do that, actually. Let's see if we're able to do it. Um, it is a real player, so let's see if we do this, this, and then uh, I guess we'll do... Hmm, I'll... Okay, so I want to get debuff before we actually do cleanse, but I guess we could just start building up the basic stats as well. I mean, that's okay too. Let's do AoE with Liz and then uh, AoE with Margaret there just to apply the crew resistance lower. And then uh, we'll deal with the uh, Esterosa and the Melee on, on these following turns. Yeah, evade food as I expected. Um, so we just waste that card right there and then we apply the crew resistance lower. That's going to be really good so that the turn two here, we can start dealing a ton of damage with uh, Mile and then, you know... Uh, Margaret maybe as well if we can get some you know cards with her. Let's see. We get dissolved on uh, Mile right there. That's fine. We need to be able to cleanse the debuffs too, because uh, that's also part of getting the uh, the thing right there, right? Um, is he gonna push ultimate with Esrosa right here? I mean, he could try. I feel like if I if I cleanse and then do the attack with Mile, I feel like I could probably get the kill on the Esrosa. Let's see though. Let's see what he's gonna do. Um, he's gonna push up the Esrosa ultimate, double attack into Margaret. Yeah, that's not, a, that's not a lot of damage, as you guys can see. Not a lot at all. Goes to the single target into the Mael right there. Literally no damage at all. Okay. I mean, I get it. I get it, right? He wants to, to push up the ultimate. That's fair. I mean, we'll try and go for the kill then. Let's do this. And then let's do this and this. That should kill the Astros right there. He's going to get the... um, What's it called? He's going to get the attack related up with melee. Let's see how much this does. Oh, wow. Okay, I didn't expect the rank 1 mile to kill right there, but it actually does get the kill. Do we attack Melly next? We attack Demon King. Okay, he's obviously going to tank that because of damage cap. But yeah, no, like that that's still pretty good for the showing right there. We do get the full heal. We are debuffed with mile right there. Uh, we we haven't we actually have not cleansed a single debuff yet, guys. So we have not procced any of the passives for uh, for the team yet. Let's see how strong Demon King is against this team now, considering that we we literally have our Lightless passive procced and we have built up some basic stats with Margaret too. Let's see, man. I'm really curious to see. This is an AOE from Demon King. I mean, that's that's pretty good considering he has these all stats up, right? AOE with Melly, and that's Melly attack related up. That's pretty insane. Let's see. And then another AoE. So he, he's... Yeah. Okay. That, that's a misplay on his part then. Look how look how little damage he did there. That wasn't anything crazy, right? I'm going to do a uh, cleanse here with Margaret. And then I'm going to go for the uh, AoE Mile. And then probably single target the, the Demon King, right? He has Tarmiel Link. Or maybe I even go for like the, the melee. I think going for the melee might be a good play too. 
Yeah, uh, let, let's go for the melee. I think we could probably kill him too. We, so we do get some crit chance, crit damage from cleansing that right there. And then uh, going for this AoE single target should do a lot of damage here. Let's see how much you're doing. Oh my gosh. Yo, that is crazy, bro. We do actually one bang the, the Kusak with the AoE right there. And now it's just the Demon King. So the Demon King can't kill our whole team with just, with just himself, right? Um, he is block affected. He, he doesn't, he has a rank 3 skill, but he's block affected, so he's not going to be doing a lot of damage. Then we just ult with Margaret and he's dead. Like, th this goes to show how strong God's team has come, where, to the point where, like, even Demon Team now, let's see if the single target kills. He's block affected, he has all stats up. Yeah, literally no damage, man, yeah. Don't forfeit, bro, don't forfeit. I want to see the Margaret ult. Oh my gosh, you see, they always be doing this, man, but there you go. I mean, it goes to show how strong Goddess Team is, is now after LR Margaret when facing teams like that. You can actually compete now. I feel like Light Liz is a, a really good option to run um, on a team like this. So there you guys go, man. Let's hop into the next match of the video. Let's see what we're able to do. All right, guys, we are hopping into the next match of the video here. We got a Sins team right here. We do actually LTC the team as well. Um, so this is obviously with... Uh, uh, LR Melly, right? It's a little bit dangerous. We don't want to obviously give him his uh, thing. Um, Terminal Link, obviously, on the DN right there. I could probably just kill the the Melly then. No, I feel like if I do this and then double double mile into the Melly, that probably kills. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. I don't know if this is gonna for sure kill, but we are gonna lower crit resistance to make sure that we guarantee crit this uh, Melly right here, and then we go for the double single target. That should be enough. He is gonna get a critical defense increase, but this should be enough damage. Let's see just enough perfect so we do kill the lr melee right there um turn one which is pretty good we did get double single target with miles to be fair i uh, maybe maybe an aoe spike probably could have did enough too regardless but i mean that that's a really good starting turn just to kill that lr melee right there he does uh i guess he's gonna push up an ultimate with uh with dn right there okay um he's not gonna do a lot of damage with the dn ultimate if he's just gonna like you know push it up without taking damage right that's the whole thing with dn is that for her to do a lot of damage she needs to be hit a ton so right there gonna do the single target we're gonna actually cleanse this um and then uh that's gonna give us the full crit chance crit damage and then uh, i'll do this and do that let's see how much this does this is rank one rank one but this should still do a lot of damage we are only we're not really building dn too much up i'm just curious to see how much this does maybe we can kill the zeldris here let's see hey are we close close that did a lot that did a lot and we got the full lightless proc so let's see how much uh, how much damage the uh, Dan's gonna do to us. She has built up a little bit of damage dealt at this point, uh, but I don't think that it's gonna like one bang us though, right? It shouldn't. It definitely shouldn't. Let's see. So he's gonna go for a follow up bond as well because he wants to do the uh, single target into a uh, Mael. Okay, so that's gonna be the the single target. Gonna go for the Dan ultimate, and then I guess follow up with uh, single target marker concentration maybe. Right? Yeah, look how much damage that did. If that's, I'm gonna check the dupes on that DN after this too. Let's see. So it goes for that. Right there, remember you cannot stat lower a, uh, a goddess team, right? So even though I have those debuffs, um, he literally can't do anything. Let's see uh, what the DN's dupes was. That's six out of six, that's crazy. That's crazy that that's six out of six, man. I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this, and then I'm gonna do the, or you know what we could do actually? Hmm. I think I will do this. I think I will do this. Because the thing is, we want to just cleanse all the debuffs, right? And then Miles going to life steal his full, uh, full health bar here. Because he has like a ton of all stats anyway. And then Margaret's going to heal up a ton too when I do this AoE. And it's also a crew resistance lower. Like, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. And then Miles... Zeldris is dead. Look at that, man. That's crazy, bro. Mile hits so hard now. 170k lifesteal. Like, what is, what is this team able to do now? Like, they can't do anything. And then I just all with Margaret and they're dead. Nah, bro. Goddess team is definitely uh, a strong team now. I would definitely say so. Um, I don't know if it's going to be, like, the best team in the game or anything like that, but it's definitely a team you can run and do well win, right? Like, I'm obviously, I'm doing really, really well against these, like, Sin teams, these Demon teams. We have yet, we only faced one unknown team, and we faced one human team as well. We got a lot of variety in this video, actually. You guys have seen a lot in this. So, we'll do one more match for the video, guys, and we'll see exactly how this goes. Uh, but yeah, man, we're almost in that champion too, though, so we've gotten somewhere, so... Let's hop into the next match and let's see what we're able to do, man. Alright, guys, we are hopping into the final match of the video. We got another, uh, what is that? LR Melly Sins team, right? Uh, let's see how we're able to deal with this team. So, the, obviously, the, the scary thing is, is the, is the, uh, Lost Vein, right? For sure. Um, he's definitely the scariest thing. If we, okay, I think this is a bot as well, because look how fast I click the cards there. Yeah. So, I think what we'll do is we'll do, uh, hmm. 
I don't want to do too much here. I think I'm going to do this. I'm going to try and go for the kill on the DN. Single target with Light Liz. Not going to do a lot of damage. Another single target with Light Liz. We do get one crit right there. Mild single target onto the DN. Yeah, good chunk of damage, but obviously Tom Yo Link's going to keep him alive, right? Um, we have a cleanse here as well. I want them to start attacking us so that we can cleanse and then get the uh, stats increase, which is going to be good. And I, what I can do too is I can do uh, Margaret Cleanse, AoE, and then Rank 2 AoE Spike. That's going to do a lot of damage, man. That's going to do an insane amount of damage, actually. Let's see. Now that attacks into Light Liz right there. He doesn't have ultimate with Lasvania. He's close, though. But I'm going to do this right here, this. And then we're going to do the rank 2 AoE. This is going to do a lot. This is spike damage, guys. This is spike damage. We cleanse all those debuffs. We do get the, uh, what is that? The crit, uh, crit chance, crit damage, right? And we do apply the crit resistance lower. AoE with mild rank 2 spike. That did a good chunk of damage. Look at, look at the Tian. Look how low the Tian's HP is. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's see how much that Lost Vein's going to do now. Because it is a little bit threatening now. I can't even lie. If he gets an ultimate up, that definitely could do a lot of damage. Okay, AoE Lost Vein does a lot right there. Um, he's going to go for the uh, single target right there with uh, Dian. A double single target with Dian right there. Crazy. Block affected the Dian. Okay, that, that's a little insane. Um, Yeah, no, the Lost Vein ultimate I think kills me. Because I don't think there's anything I can really do here, considering he's block affected and all of that. Um, yeah. Because I can go for the crew resistance AoE again, but I don't think it's going to do enough. And then we only have a single target we here with Mile, but we could try. We can try, right? Um, let's do this, and let's do Mile single target and see if that kills the DN. I'll be, I'll be shocked. I'll be shocked if it kills the DN, right? I'll be, I'll be pretty shocked if it kills. Um, let's see, though. We do the crew resistance lower. We go for the single target. Close, man, close. You see, that's a situation where I feel like if I had the Elab backline, I probably would have got the kill, right? Running Tristan backline just means that I'm a lot more tanky. It doesn't mean necessarily that I'm going to be, you know, doing too much more differently. So uh, that is the only thing right there that I feel like uh, changes. But yeah, I mean, Lost Vein Ultimate is probably going to wipe me here. Let's see. Do we tank? Yeah, well, okay. We actually do tank. I have my ultimate here. Uh, he does have ultimate with DM, but he's block affected. But he does have damage dealt, right? He does have damage dealt. Let's see. We get wiped. Okay, I mean, there you go, man. I mean, there are obviously teams that can counter the guys team, and it seems like Sins is one of them. We had a good, we had a good match the the actual player Sins, but when we're facing a bot, we get kind of rolled. And it, I guess, I guess, because it is just Lost Vein, right? Because it's hard to actually attack him unless you have like a double single target, like I did that one turn. So there you guys go, man. I hope you guys do enjoy the video. That is pretty much the showcase right there for LR Margaret. I think she's a great character, um, and definitely a good LR. But the problem is with with Goddess team right now in PvP is that they don't really have like another dps character like margaret obviously is nice because she has the crew resistance lower but it doesn't make her like a dps you know what i mean like because she has that that doesn't make her enough to do like a you know a million aoe like the way mile can do it right if they had another dps maybe if it was like lr sariel or even like lr like yeah, i mean lr tarmiel could have been pretty good too blue tarmiel for like a de defense team they could add blue margaret uh tarmiel mael tristan backland that would have been crazy too right think about that but yeah, I mean, you know, there obviously is like, you know, uh, other characters that I feel like were more deserving of LR than Ludo or uh, Margaret Ludo. But I, th I still think she's worth. Um, she's definitely a really good character. And uh, yeah, man, there is the showcase for you guys there, man. LR Margaret is pretty good. I hope you guys do enjoy the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe as always. If you guys want to see more videos like this, definitely let me know in the comment section below. And I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Peace out and have a great rest of your day, guys. See you later, man.